Hello, this is Blake Cousins, third phase moon, taking calls from around the world. This is it is FM. Right. Lance. Lance. Lance, where dude, dude, I, I, something's going on. I'm not hearing. Is that? Did I hear correctly, Lance? I just see new footage of this. You see the new footage I got of the same craft. Okay, okay. Oh, wait a second. I, I'm not quite hearing it. Lance Robertson, the man that yeah. just. Okay. Wow. We've been wanting to talk to you. You've been. We've been trying to call. You're not returning our calls. What's going on? Is you got something else to uh, share with us? I saw the video I posted. Same address I posted the last one. This is looks like the same craft. It was notified to me by a friend of mine. <laughs> Close friend. Well, I know you guys get calls in about people talking. Oh wow, we're uh, unfortunately there's a lot of breakup here. Uh, we just got the video. So we're looking at it. Brent, go ahead. Okay, tell me. Oh, it's like, is this the same aircraft that you shot? It looks like the same aircraft. You guys have people want to summon these aircraft, and I'm starting to feel like that I have the ability to do this. But the point is that I got a call from someone who told me they saw something in the sky, and I went out to their location. Here it is, the same vehicle again. So, if you guys have any information for me based on my last posting on what this is, because obviously this looks like it's something mechanical. It looks like something that was created here. It doesn't look like it's something from somewhere else. This looks like it's military. I don't know about. Wow, well, you know. Uh... Wow, we lost uh, Lance right now. We lost Lance. It sounds like. Uh... There's not anything coming in from Lance, but this video is quite uh, most impressive and I have not seen anything like it. I'm gonna be shutting off the phone and hopefully we get a call back from uh, Lance and just we'll take a look at this uh, video as we stand by for the phone call. No, Brent, look, stand by. The, the oscillation on this is absolutely most impressive. There's, uh, it seems very stable unlike the last video where it seemed like people were saying it's some kind of string on a, on a, you know, a speaker system of some sort or a drip pen, but this seems quite stable. It could not possibly be uh, suspended by a string. You could see the clouds in the background. And this is Brent. Now what, I know you were kind of a skeptic in the beginning saying that this could be some kind of uh, CGI effect, but what are you taking a look at this now, Brent? Well, the first video that Lance gave us seems to be it was hard to tell him the vehicle or whatever it was had a certain wobble that seemed to not, you know, it could have been something hanging on a string, just like you're saying, like, oh, wait, hold on. Let's take this call. Okay, this is uh, coming in from a. Uh, it seems to be Lance. Lance, are you with us? Third phase, this is Cousin Brothers? This is uh, Third Phase. So we just lost you, but we're looking over your video. And I, uh, you know, what do you. Come on, Lance, we're looking at it. Is this some kind of massive CGI hoax? I, I don't want to offend, but it's one of the most incredible videos that I've seen so far. You know, I got nothing to tell you except the question. I want you guys to tell me what this is. I, I am like the last time I called. This is approximately a week after the last time I called. This is a, obviously the same craft. This is the same vehicle. There's no question about that. It's the same area. What is the reason why it's here? I'm trying to find out answers. And if you guys can help let me, me find an answer on what this is, I'd appreciate it. But my intuition tells me that this is something military. Okay, we, Lance, you know, there's a lot of people that just want to know exactly where this is, GPS coordinates, where uh, this school exactly was. And we're, that's the whole point. Everybody wants to share information and we want to know exactly where this is shot so we could investigate this a little bit more. Lance? Uh, I respected you to get it more, but I have my life here, and I don't know what this is. I'm coming to you guys for answers to these questions, and I'm not guys, my family, my community over what's going on over here. I think that this is something typical. I don't think this is something from outer space. I don't think this is something alien. I think this is something domestic, and I expect answers and to identify what this is. And if you can help me get to those answers, I'd appreciate it. Because again, the same emotions of excitement and the thrill and just hit the lottery or what the hell is going on here. This is, uh, we're living in the future. If you guys can help me define what this is, I'd appreciate it. 
Lance, if uh, you're looking for help, we might be able to. I know maybe um, I, you got a family. We understand that. What if off the record, could we maybe um, collaborate? Because this is something that could be smoking gun proof. You may have it, Lance. How could we collaborate? You tell me. I'm open to anything. You know, I, I just have limits on what I can do on a social, personal, uh, lifestyle level. But I'm looking for answers, and I believe that this is something that is an answer. This is not abnormal. I don't know if this is following me around, or it's coincidence, or it's chance, or it's... Let me ask you this, Lance. Did you see any kind of... Uh, some people say this could be some new technology. People have come it to the Searle device, possibly mag magnetation uh, formula going off here. Did you see any kind of disturbance with underneath the craft? Did it seem like there's any propulsion device? Was there again any sound on the second sighting? Oh no, uh, we just lost uh, again. We lost Mr. Lance Robertson, that's just, again, sent us some incredible footage. We're standing by and we're hoping he could call us back. Uh, probably the fastest, okay, the, one of the fastest hit videos ever. Now we got uh, Lance Robertson back on a uh, line. Lance, are you with us? Yeah, I'm back with you. And you know, I'm in a remote area. I'm not in a metropolitan area. I'm in a remote area. And, you know, I know you guys have like, people on your show who claim they can summon and call these things. I'm not doing anything, specific, but I don't know. This is too quick of an occurrence after the initial that this resulted. I first started seeing things, I don't know, six months before I started filming them. <laughs> and now it's almost like I'm a magnet and they're coming to me. Okay. I don't know if this is from outer space or this is domestic. My intuition is that this is domestic, and I want some explanations. Okay, Lance, people are going to ask this question. Why did he only, why is there only so much footage? You only gave us maybe, what, 10 seconds of raw? What's yeah, I think on? there's two videos. One was about seven seconds. This one is approximately uh, 12 to 20 seconds. Uh, do you have more footage, and why isn't it coming in? You know, I have more footage, but why it's not coming in is because it's not worth sending to you. You know, you want extra seconds of what you've seen already? I'm happy to send that to you, but essentially the situation is like this. There it is. We want Shoot everything. it and grab the camera and start filming this thing. What happened after? I don't, I don't have extensive footage of this stuff. This is, this is, if I could count on one hand how many times I've seen these events without having the camera ready. This camera ready footage is unique. And this is something that I think is domestic because of its provenance. Well, let's, uh, uh, what I would say right now, this is new footage coming into third phase moon. We're uh, gonna look over the video. I'd say we discussed this uh, conversation a little further, but off the, just let's shut the recording off and uh, we'll continuously we speak. We need some more information and can't Lance can't give it to us on uh, on air right now on uh, YouTube, but I wanted to say- Did you to you there? If uh, everybody uh, stand by, we're going to hopefully get some more information coming in from Lance in the near future. Keep your eyes on the skies. And if you've, you're in the Colorado area or anybody, you can contact Third Phase of Moon via Skype or Facebook, Third Phase of Moon. We'll see everybody again. Have a good one, Edward.